Yo, what up, you two? Yeah, man. So we just finished that um that 500 uh, push-ups a day challenge, man. 15 days in a row. It got me in a hoopy today. But um, let's get into why um, uh, truck drivers swap jobs so much, man. Why do they swap jobs so much? Why aren't the truck drivers satisfied with where they at? Uh, well, the main reason is because trucking is huge, man. It's too big, you can't box it in. The trucking industry is huge, man. It's uh, it's levels to this shit. I mean, it's like the little rappers say, man. It's, it's, it's levels to this shit, man. Um, you got LTL, you got Over the Road, you got Specialized. I mean, it, and, the, and then within that, you got so much shit going on, man, where you can make just, you know, different types of money, man. And, um, you know, you get into trucking the first year, you just hear all of this stuff coming at you at one time. You're just like, damn, man, what, what am I supposed to do? Hey, go local, man. Hey, stay over the road. Ain't no money doing this. You know, you find out, uh, they tell you ain't no money local. Then you find out, oh, it's a, it's a guy uh, driving local making $80,000 a year and you busting your ass out there for a 50. You know, going for two and three weeks at a time, man. So, you know, you just gotta, you know, do your research, find out who you are, you know, what type of person you are, man. If you're an introvert, you know, you don't like to be around a lot of people, man, you're quiet, man. Over the road might be the best bet for you, man. Or you could come to an LTL drive and do what I'm doing, man. You can do, um, Line haul, road driver, whatever, you know, whatever they call it, but it's a uh, line haul. Um, you know, you miss the personality, man. You're an extrovert. You know, I, you know, do local, man. You, you watch a lot of sports, man. You know, you go to your customers, man, and talk sports with them or whatever, man, and shoot the shit with them. Um, you know, get through your day if that makes you happy, man. Hey, man, go local, man, but... Um, the best paying local jobs are going to be with LTL companies, man. You got a lot of local companies, but the best ones that's going to pay between, you know, anywhere from $23 to $30 an hour is going to be local, man, um, in, the, in the LTL, man. Well, um, you know, getting a job at UPS, but, um, you know, you just got to find your place, what you like, man. And then, you know, if you like to get dirty, man. You can get into uh, bull, you know, bull hauling it, man. Uh, you know, dealing with the uh, livestock. You got that. Uh, what else? Uh, you got end dump. You know, you can haul rocks. You know, you like to get dirty. I like to get dirty myself, man. Um, you know, I'd rather be hauling rocks, man, myself. But you know, that's not. I live in Atlanta, so that's not. That's not a big industry in Atlanta. I mean, it's real small. Um, you know, rock hauling, man, you, you know, you start, that's when you start making your money, man, out, you know, out there in the Midwest, man, you know, pulling end dumps. Um, I think, you know, up north, I mean, just, like, rock hauling, man, it's just, just certain parts of the country, man. I, I just won't be able to make the kind of money I like to make in Atlanta, hauling rocks, but uh, that, that, but that's what I like to do. I like to get dirty, man. Your boy like to work, throw the boots on, jumpsuit, get dirty, man. Throw my PPE on, my hard hat, all of that, man. That's me. That's what I like to do. But, uh, yeah, man, just, yo, find your place, man. Find out, first of all, you got to find out who you are. And then you got to move on from there, man. Because trucking, man, you, it, it's just so much coming at you, man. Especially your first year, man. You don't know what the hell to do, man. Because you got, you know, and then you got, um, you got you guys going from Mega Carrier to Mega. Hey, man, we making, uh. 45 cents over here, we're making 50 cents over here, boom, boom, boom. <clears throat> but now you got to deal with, they might not be getting you home the way you want to get home making that 50 cent a mile. You know, you might not be getting the miles you get making that 50 cent a mile. You need, you know, is if you can run, if, especially if you're over the road, the only mileage matters only in an over the road situation, really. When you start, uh, start calculating miles, man, uh, because you're not getting a lot of clock time and stuff like that. So, you know, in the over-the-road scenario, man, if you, um, if you're running, you 
Canada, you got a company paying 55 cents a mile over the road, man, and they only you're only getting 1,800 miles a week. You know, compared to making uh, 45 cents a mile, and you're getting 3,000 miles a week. Hey, man, you, we can coming out better. You're away from home anyway, so you'd rather be driving. You know, making that money, man, and getting it, man. But yeah, that's my take on it, man. Stop job hopping. You know, first thing you need to do first year, first you need to learn how to drive before you start doing all this damn hopping, man. Just going around tearing up everybody's shit. But uh, learn how to drive first and then start making your move. Realize, you know, figure out what type of person you are, man. But get that one year in, man, and, you know, make your moves. Peace.